It is finally done. Everything turned out so perfect. I can't wait for one of you guys to come stay here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We are at our Airbnb. Oh my gosh, you guys, this is so exciting. It is finally done. It's finally done, and today we're finally gonna give you the long-awaited Airbnb tour that you guys have been wanting to see. So if you guys know, we actually renovated this entire Airbnb. We're so proud of it. We're so excited because it's in a beautiful location, and yeah, it's finally available. By the time you guys watch this video, it will already be on Airbnb. So if you're coming to Gilbert, Arizona, look it up, and uh, it's in a beautiful location. We're like literally walking distance to downtown Gilbert with some of the best restaurants. Yeah. So I can't wait, but let's just show you guys Guys, Let's go right for inside. it. I'm so excited. So the first thing that we did is we actually, the outdoors was green and we painted it white and black. This door is super cute. I love the black door, super fun. And let's go inside. Ooh. Welcome to our Airbnb. This looks so this good. This is so pretty. I can't wait for you guys to see the whole thing. But right when you walk in, you guys will see a beautiful living room. This couch is so comfy and it's super cute. And then we added some artwork. We wanted to keep it nice and clean and simple. It's a big area for people to gather and have fun and I love it. I really want to show you guys a before picture of this room and then we're gonna pop in the after photo after so this is the before and this is the after it's so beautiful and I'm so proud of how it turned out all right now I'm gonna show you the kitchen this is probably one of my favorite parts of the whole house it looks incredible in here before I really show you the kitchen though you gotta look at this before picture it's crazy so as you guys saw, there was actually a wall right here and we knocked it down, had to add this beam across because for support on the roof. And then we added beautiful white cabinets. I absolutely love this countertop too. I think this countertop looks beautiful. Bella, what's your favorite part? Okay, my favorite part would have to be, okay, we added the countertop and it extends out so there's like all the stools right here. But I love how we added, the, we did the backsplash, a continuation of the countertop. We actually got some inspo from our friends, Lauren and Ari, their house does this. And I thought it was so cool. So we added this on the backsplash and of course the white cabinets and I just love like the natural light that comes from the store it's so cute and I just I couldn't even have thought I could have never thought that this kitchen could even look like this this is crazy how it used to look like it's crazy wait scary. let me scoot back but I'm gonna get a full view of this kitchen I love it look at that and this dining room area really nice fridge we have here super nice and then the dining area I love the artwork that we chose here and of course all the little stools they just everything turned out so perfect and I could totally see this being like a huge gathering space and the kitchen is the most important part of home i believe so i just love this space and when you book the airbnb you actually get um, a special guest that you don't know is in the house oh, you do you do bella should we, should we show them in this video sure the one and only yeah. I'll be here every time. You this book kid's hiding in the time background. Time. I'll be here every time you book the Airbnb. Say hi to me. Every time his future wife, he's like, hey. I know, maybe she'll be here. He's just hiding in the corner. No, big shout out to Tanner. He just took pictures for us. He won't so. actually be here, so don't get too excited. Yeah. No, no, he won't. Anyway, you guys, the kitchen looks insane, and this dining room area, Bella did a really good job. I love the prints on the wall back me there. Too. I think it looks Everything so good. Everything is just so cool in this house. Okay, should we show them more? Okay. Take us back to the We're room. Just started. Wait, wait, oh, I gotta mention one other thing too. Yeah. So, right here, you guys, let me just explain something. The ceiling dropped, as you can see. Well, if you look in the before picture, the ceiling, was like the ceiling dropped in the kitchen and yes. out here in the hallway. It was super short ceiling. So we literally- Now head almost hit the top. So we had we, to raise the roof, you know what I'm saying? We raised the roof, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, but it, it made the kitchen look so much bigger. Yeah. We did some pretty intense projects. And I don't think Bella said either, but we shiplapped this wall, which I think is just beautiful. Yeah. It looks really pretty. And then in this hallway, it used to be a really narrow hallway. At the end of the hallway, we have to post a picture right here. So it was basically like a cabinet space and it went into the master closet. Like it's hard to explain, but let's just go back here and you'll see. As you walk down the hall, you get to the first bedroom and this one might be a favorite of mine. I don't, I, I think they're all my favorite, but this one's so pretty. Dallin did the wallpaper. All the wallpaper in the home is actually from our favorite wallpaper place, Loomwell. So Yo, you guys ever big before? shout out to Loomwell. Wait, we can talk into this. Loomwell <laughs> hooked it up. So huge thanks to them. Yeah. I'm going to put their Instagram right here. And so uh, if you guys ever need wallpaper. Airbnb. I can't either. This babe. is crazy. This is so but cool. We wanted to do like a cute, like light theme, add a little pop of color in this room. So we did like the blush wallpaper from Luma. The coolest thing about their wallpaper is it's actually like a sticker. So you can peel it off and it doesn't damage the paint. So if we ever want to change it up, we could. Uh, this is a queen bed. So we did a queen bed in here because we have one room with a king, one room with a queen, and then two twin beds you're about to see. And this is just super nice. We added in the closets. I added some extra blanket and a fan just in case. We do live in Arizona. The AC in here is amazing. But the blankets are 
are just in case you get cold. Hey, I just gotta say too, if I can put up the wallpaper, any of you guys yeah, can. That's it's true. super easy to put up. It's just a big sticker we'll that goes do, on the wall. We'll do a link in our description of Loomwell so you guys can check them out. I think they just make a room look so much more complete. It turned this boring room into so much nicer. It like adds, the pink, yeah. it just looks so much better. It added so much. All right, Bella, take us to the bathroom. Ooh, the bathroom looks so okay, good. Really quick, let's show them the before photo of the bathroom before we enter so you can see the after in real life. So here's the before. And here is the after. Oh my gosh, we did Are so much work in right this now? place. This is just crazy. The tile looks so good. It is so pretty in here. I can't get over how beautiful this bathroom is. So let's talk about this. We decided we wanted to add tile, like a really pretty tile shower with a beautiful shower head. Great pressure in here. And then <laughs> I added these cute little containers to refill our shampoo, conditioner, and body wash. So that's super fun. And then the flooring in here is possibly my favorite flooring in the whole house. I just love this so much. It turned out so cute. Nice. And everything about this is just so It's just so pretty. cute. And when you guys so are taking a shower, you can think about how traveling is the best thing ever. I thought that was a cute little print. I so. love it. Wait, wait, we look cute right here. Look how cute we are. I love this. <laughs> All right, let me show them the master. Oh, you get to show them the master? Oh my God, let me show you. Actually, yeah, I'll show you the master because I know you like the other one yeah, so much. Yeah, yeah. So I put the wallpaper up in this room too. This room is nice. It's big. We have a king bed in here. Big giant bed. Oh my gosh. Yes. This is so, so pretty! Look how cool the light fixture is too. I love the light fixture and I put this wallpaper up. It took me like 30 minutes and I just think I love the contrast with the dark. I think it looks so good. The I master is beautiful. This is a king bed, you guys. A nice big bed right here. The wallpaper is beautiful. Yeah, make sure that looks nice, babe. You just Sorry. jumped on it. Sorry. Then we added a full length mirror in this room because we thought that would be a nice little touch for the master bedroom. And yeah. I'm so excited. This I'm is so, so fun. I'm so excited too. This is so cool. All right, Bella, you gotta show them the coolest room out okay. of everything. I love this room. So then the final room that we have in this house is the little bunk bedroom. So this one is actually super big, which I like, but it's- This room is massive. Little bunk beds that we added. And I added the cute little peace sign pillows because I thought those were fun. And the one thing that I love about every single one of these rooms, by the way, is we have a remote control fans. So you can turn on the light, you can turn on the fan if you want, and everything is super high tech, you know? But anyway, we added this cute little bunk bedroom with two twin beds, and then it has a nice little full like mirror over here. I added the cute little travel map. I thought that was super fun. Oh, that's cool. And I just love this room. This whole house. I love it. Like, I really love this whole house. I just get so excited. We always want to drive here and just like come check it out because it's just so cute and so fun. We worked so hard on this and it feels so good to finally have this project done. Like we did this. High five, babe. All right, so this area right here is really interesting because there was no outside door to the back. And I really wanted to change that. And so there was a wall right here actually, and you'd go in the master, come down here, and this was the closet of the master. So in the master bedroom, there was a massive closet right here. And so we ended up ripping out this wall. We drywalled in the door that was right here going into the closet. And then we added this door going out the back. And we added this really cool tile as well, a light right here. That way there's a way to go out of the back. There was no back door. There there was no back door. And I really wanted one with a window in it that you can close and open because it just brings in so much more light into yeah. this house. This house really lacked light. And so by doing that, we really just brightened it up, opened up the house. As you guys have been seeing the before pictures, it's crazy. I mean, it's a completely different house, but I'm just so excited, so epic. I can't wair for one of you guys to come stay here. And uh, this is our Airbnb, it's crazy. All right, so that is the Airbnb. Comment down below what you think of the before and after. I think it's pretty amazing, but I want to know your opinion. Let me know also if you're gonna stay here. That'd be kind of cool. That'd be awesome. Um, but we're just super excited about this and we wanted to end off the tour with a little montage. So what do you say? All right. So enjoy this montage and we'll see you guys in the next video. And we have some big news in the next video. So stay tuned. You don't want to miss it guys. All right. We'll see you guys later. Bye.